Ladies and gentlemen, Parade Marshal Chris Fout is putting the horses postward for the dots first race. Pacing fillets and mares, racing one mile. A field of nine, there are no changes. Here's the lineup, number one, Pocket Locket. Old by Tal McConkey of Waverly, Ohio. Terry Thompson, Jr. drives. Two is simply Heather, owned by Rick Jordan and Letha Brooks of Ohio with Rick Jordan. Number three, BJ's Retirement, owned by Edgar Jennings of New Lebanon with Dave Miller. Number four, Tucson Sweetie, owned by Wiley Lyons Jr. of Xenia with Brett Elliott. Number five is Good to Move, owned by Francis Hammond and Andrew Roberts of Kentucky, Phil Siebolda. Number six, Bikini Bird, laced by Craig Parker of Columbus for Keith Justice. Seven is Sparkling Chatter, owned by Jim Ross of Greenville, Tom Hope aboard. Number eight, Jory, the by Warren Long of South Charleston, Brent Holland in the bike. The nine, Miss Cash, owned by Larry Braley and Dean Gillespie of Ohio, Dean Gillespie in the sulky. One play show, perfected, trifected, daily double wagering. On the backstretch, nearing the start. And they're off from the far outside. Jory sprinting clear for the lead from the inside. It's simply Heather from mid-track three. Good to move from the inside fourth. BJ's retirement. Early five, it's sparkling chatter to the inside in sixth. Tucson, sweetie. Dropping in seventh. Bikini Bird along the rail in eighth. It's Miss Cash. Early trailer ninth, pocket locket. Maybe the first quarter mile marker in Holland has the eight Jory on the front end here leading by a length. The two simply Heather in the pocket is second. BJ's retirement coming out early third at the first quarter, 29 seconds. Good to move remains fourth on the rail. It's a gap of four lengths to Sparkling Chatter. She's fifth and another five lengths to Tucson Sweetie sixth. Three lengths seventh now to Bikini Bird of the outside eighth comes Miss Cash. The trailer is pocket locket. As they race towards the half, it's Jory with the lead uh, to the outside. BJ's retirement is there, pressuring second. And simply Heather behind the battle is racing third at the half. 58 and four. Along the rail, good to move is racing fourth. And to the outside comes Sparkling Chatter as she gets in the way, but she's gapping her cover by three lengths. She's racing fifth. And with her cover sixth now, it's Tucson Sweetie as they race down the back stretch with Jory still in control here. Inside, Simply Heather is now locked in second. BJ's retirement getting the whip on the outside. And is urged on by Miller is third. With that cover comes Sparkling Chatter as they reach the three quarters, 129 and two. Midway to the final turn, and it's Jory, 12 to one shot, looking for the upset here. Simply Heather, 25 to one, is now looking for racing room as she comes out. And here comes Sparkling Chatter, less than an eighth of a mile ago. And down the stretch they come, Jory with the lead. But Simply Heather has yet to be moved, and she comes to the outside with authority. And Simply Heather has a lead, but here comes heavily favored Sparkling Chatter. And to the inside is Bikini Bird, but it's Simply Heather in front. The trifecta 267 paying $1,578.40, 157840 And trackside is the winner now of the first at 25 to 1. It's simply Heather, a three year old out of Simcoe Hanover from Heather's Image. Oh, by Rick Jordan and Letha Brooks of Ohio. Rick Jordan, the trainer and driver. Simply Heather getting the garden spot trip the entire mile, shaking loose at the top of the stretch to score her first career win in 201 and do one fifth. Complete order of results of the one pocket locket.